The Land Cruiser 300 2025, the model was introduced at a live event in the Middle East, one of the world's largest automotive markets. In such event, the existing 6-speed automatic transmission will be replaced by the new 10-speed, a design modification that will undoubtedly improve acceleration and open-road fuel economy. Another major adjustment is the decision to reduce engine capacity to AV6. This decision is consistent with the global trend of using smaller displacement engines to meet stricter pollution rules. While these requirements may not be as stringent as those in other nations, automakers have made adjustments to better accommodate global market trends. While hybrid propulsion has not been specified, it is likely that it will be available in Australia between now and 2025, around the time the Land Cruiser-based Lexus LX makes its debut. Are you disappointed that Toyota's newest model has switched from AV8 to AV6 engine? Positive news, Toyota has now announced that the single-turbo V8 engine will continue to be produced on the Toyota Land Cruiser 70 series. However, it is projected that this engine would eventually switch to TDV6 power. The new model includes numerous new features, with a focus on safety, performance, and innovative design especially in a variety of tough off-road settings. The latest Toyota model weighs about 100 kilograms lighter than its predecessor. Nonetheless, its proportions are comparable to those of its predecessor, which measured 4,990 millimeters long and 1980 millimeters wide. Although it is lighter and more rigid, its 3,500 kilograms towing capacity remains unchanged. Despite being lighter than its predecessors, the Toyota Land Cruiser 300 comes equipped with a slew of essential amenities. Australians will have access to a 3.3L diesel engine that produces 227 kilowatts at 4,000 RPM and 700 Newton meters of torque, between 1,600 and 2,600 RPM. Toyota claims that the 3.3L V6 engine offers more flexibility and performance than the V8. The lifting capability is 13% more than previous generations produced by Toyota. The Middle East will see the introduction of a new 3.5L twin-turbo gasoline V6, but not in Australia. A specialized multi-terrain choose system allows the user to change between numerous off-road setups.